I managed to join the profiling team to Burkina Faso. That time I traveled with a professional called Simiu and uh, Emily. Emily from Madare. We went to Burkina Faso, Wagadugu City. We went to help the slum dwellers there to do uh, profiling and enumeration. Uh, it was my first exchange and it was good. Uh, knowing that other countries also have slums, uh, knowing that uh, community, okay, slum dwellers come together to solve their problems. So the, the exchange helped me know how to do, that was my first uh, profiling and enumeration. So I, I was I was excited uh, numbering the the houses and then with the sanitation have managed to go to Tanzania the twice on sanitation issue there was a project which was being done by Tanzania Zimbabwe and Zambia so we were just joined in uh, when they were finishing just to, sh to see what they are doing, share our experience, sh they should, and they were sharing their own experience. So from there I learned a lot because we come from different countries, different communities. So what works in Kenya does not work in another country. Like here in Kenya we are very strong, strong in advocacy. We can go demonstrate on the street. Uh, bring okay make the government feel that we we are there but when you go to Tanzania they are a bit cool they call the government they talk things slowly but I don't think they 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 have that they the government really okay the government is working with them but they the government does not feel the federation that much because it is a you come let's talk that is over. In Kenya it is, we, if things don't work, we go to the street, demonstrate, and they feel that these people need this. Although they don't really, they don't really come in, but they know there is a movement called Mungano and Vijiji, and this is, this is what Mungano and Vijiji is doing. And with that, when they'll be coming to join us, you know, they'll have that feeling of, working with us from the start to the end then bringing them on the table taking tea having lunch talking and everything is they forget after marching out of the door zimbabwe i had they had problem with the starting having to put up a toilet without water you first put out put water then you put a, a toilet it goes together so i learned so many things with the different countries with their different projects that they are doing which is not the same okay with implementation is the same with us but the way they go about it, it is different uh, again i went back to tanzania also on sanitation and that is sim uh, simplified siwa it is a new thing and uh, I felt it can work, it can work, but it cannot work in Mukuru because we, the place is congested, our slums are very congested, there is no place that you can put those small sewers to, to connect to the main. But with the Tanzania, Vingunguti, they have big houses, more space, in fact where people pathways are big see what can be put so it is working with them they have put toilets flash toilets connected to the sewer and that is something good that uh, maybe a, a slum that is coming up government can take such an initiative uh, to put sewer system those small small sewers so that people can have good sanitation